What's going on guys? Back at it again with another Fallout 3 video. In this one, I'm actually planning to go backwards in time and actually complete or at least get started uh, the the quest with Moira Brown over at uh, Megaton, the Wasteland Survival Guide as you see right here. Um, we had gotten it started very early in our reboot, I guess you can say. But we never actually completed it, uh, mainly because I kind of wanted to go on further with the storyline. So I want to go ahead and do that in this video. So if that's something you guys are excited for, do me a huge favor. Drop a like on this video. Also subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, let's go ahead and just jump right into this. Alright, let's go ahead and go. Uh, let's change this. Alright, I do need ammo, man. I don't have that much. It's kind of a part of the reason why I want to go backwards and go back to some of the earlier areas. Um, hold on. Um, show location right there. All right. So yeah, uh, just because I I I know these guys are gonna be a lot easier to kill, so I kind of want to do that. What the fuck? Ah! So much for being easier. <laughs> so much for being easier. What the hell? Oh, fuck you, Yao Guai. You almost killed me, dude. What the hell? Alright, um... <laughs> that was funny. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, plus 10 HP. I'll take another one. Screw it. Uh, I'll eat all of this. I'll eat that. And I'll take two stim packs. That should get us at a pretty decent location. Let's search these guys real quick. Yes, please. There's another one right here too. So, um, the good thing is we recently did this portion. Well, at least not recently, recently, but like relatively recently, we did this portion of this quest. So, it should be pretty fresh in my mind. All right, uh, let's kill, let's kill this guy real quick. This dude is literally running away like a coward. So I'll dispose of him like a coward. Deuces, bruh. I need more fusion cells. Oh, shit. Um. Oh, God, dude. Maybe I should have waited for the looting, huh? No. Who are you shooting at? Alright, let's come over here. Because I get the feeling that everyone's going to want to come and uh, get a piece of this. Alright, we'll take a couple of these. Oh, oh shit. Get a couple headshots here. You know, this was supposed to be easy. Oh no. I got a I got a head injury. Maybe we should have uh, actually came a little earlier. I'll take the medics though for sure. Alright, uh do I have any other guns? With ammo? No. Crap, this is the only gun I have ammo for. Fuck. No. Oh. Luckily, there's a bunch of raiders around here that, uh... Would love to donate. Ah! Uh. Look at him looking at his dead buddy. He's like, oh shit, my homeboy is dead. Alright, I'm getting back. For a quick second, regenerate some of my AP. All right, he's coming. He's literally behind this door. Nice try there, buddy. You're Dunskies. Woo-wee, I blew off his head. I mean, the good thing is that there's beds right here too, so. Oh, I, I had a feeling, dude. I'm actually gonna equip th that assault rifle. Uh, where's it at? Only because I'm running low on ammo and I don't want to completely be out. Oh! 
I don't know why I changed my camera view. I pushed the wrong button. I think she had it the worst. Uh, I'll take that, I'll take that, that, that. You know what, I'll take that too, fuck it. Uh, can I sleep? Beautiful. Beautiful. I think everybody's done skis. Uh, I'll take that too. Oh wait, junk food? I'll take that. Dude, these guys are awfully generous. Generous just donating all of their... Their stuff to me, you know? Alright, so part one of this is... Alright, we have to go in there. But we can't go in there because it's locked. I believe, if I remember correctly... Um... It's over here. Uh, right? Metal box? There it is. Very nice. Alright, let's go. Had a feeling he was in one of those boxes. And... Bam! Just like that. Alright, so... This is the medical supplies. Uh, let's take medics. Stim pack and right away. Ah, fuck it. I'll take... I'll take all of that. Look at that. I'll take the mini nuke. Why not? Definitely take... The ammo as well, man. Those things will definitely come in handy. Give me all the drugs, dude. I could sell this shit. I'll take the Nuka-Cola Quantums. For a specific quest later. I believe it's this one. It's not New Vegas. It's this one, I believe. With the, uh... With, uh... Somebody open up the... Uh -oh. Hang on. Something ain't right here. Hello. Oh, this dude has a shotgun. Die! Oh god. That dude took a shitload of freaking... To kill... To... Get him down as far as I got. Okay, so I need headshots for this asshole. Come on. Woo! Oh! Oh god, I'm out. Um, I got the 10mm submachine gun too. I'm already running out of ammo. Again. Alright, good. That guy's done, skis. Alright, come on. Get out of there. Oh, uh, I'm not gonna do anything with that combat knife. Oh, God. You know what? I like this gun. Alright. Alright. This guy definitely has shotgun shells, and I do have a combat shotgun. I'll take that combat shotgun too, actually. Just to repair my other one. I know there's somebody else here, dude. Um, shut the hell up. Let's get closer. Oh no, I'm out of ammo. Uh, shotgun. Oh, dude, you are screwed, man. Point blank to the face. Come on, baby. Oh man. Eh, she be aight. Alright, let's go ahead and do some, uh... Some weapon fixing really fast. Alright. Do I have any other duplicates? I don't think so. So we're probably going to take a nap before we leave, too. I think it's in here. Oh, yeah, it is. It's right here in this refrigerator. Alright, uh, I'll take all of this. Amazing! Alright, really fast, though. Let's go ahead and go back. Um, Actually, I think it's in that far side. Let's go over there and take a quick nap so that we can go back to Moira and hopefully she's happy at us. Right over here. Thank you guys for the bed. You guys are awfully kind. And hopefully all this uh, chems that I 
picked up, man, I'll be able to sell to Moira. That way I could buy some ammo. Alright, um... Data, world map, Megaton. All right. Looking for the mayor or the sheriff? Shut up, Sims. They should have gave him more lines if he was going to be this talkative. There it goes. Crater side supply. Moira, where you at? Oh, it's Billy Creel. So, how's the scaving been? Got the food medicine from that super duper mart? I, I, I did. Oh, I was scared. Uh, it wasn't easy, but I got the food and the medicine. Really? You did? Yep. You did? Well, all right. Tell me all about it. Well, first of all, it was extremely dangerous, and I almost died. But I got it all. Uh, well, there was no robot. This is fake as shit, so... The raiders were using the pharmacy as a place to store their best gear. Sure, why not? So you're saying that they acquired a well-protected stash? Hmm, I wonder how many other places are hiding treasures behind monsters. Hmm. Well, keep what you got. Just traded for a big food shipment myself. Here, take a bit, my treat. Tastes kind of great after a while. Thank you. Oh, and take this. It's an old food sanitizer. Just carry it with you, and it should automatically make most food and drink more, uh, better. <laughs> more better? Um, alright, you keep that vernacular. Uh, I'm ready to continue my research on the first chapter. I still need to study a living specimen with radiation poisoning. I need someone to research how to travel through a minefield. And that'll cover the first section of the book. Which strikes your fancy? Uh, let's go do the landmines. Only because, there, I mean, we can always stand. What we did last time is we stood in front of the bomb in the water or whatever until we became severely radiated. But that kind of takes a while, dude. So I kind of want to do the landmines first and then finish it up with the radiation. Uh, so, yeah, well, let's go do the landmines first. Landmines are one of the few dangers out there that you can profit from. Disarm one before it blows, and you can sell it for plenty of caps. I've heard stories about a ghost town that's just full of mines. Traders just call the place Minefield. Sounds like the place for some field work. Get in there, get back, and tell me all about it. And could you bring back a mine for my studies? Yeah, no worries. Uh, I, I suppose I'll head into Minefield. Wish me luck. Oh, don't worry. No one ever goes there because they say it's a ghost town. And since ghosts don't exist, you can just focus on the landmines. <laughs> I hear there's a playground in the middle of town. Reach that point and come back, and I'm sure you'll have some stories to tell. Uh, yep, let's go. Uh, how do I, how do I, well, actually, first things first, Absolutely. let's go ahead and sell some stuff to her. Uh, let me sell everything I don't need nor want. I have no ammo for this. Yeah, I'm going to sell this to her. I'll keep this just in case, and I do have a little bit of rounds for it, too. There's no way I'm selling the my birthday gift. Uh, I'll keep the shotgun. That thing is pretty strong. Definitely not selling those. Um, let me see here. Food sanitizer? the hell do I need this for? Sell. You know what? I'm selling all these frag grenades. I really hate throwables in this game. Uh, Jet. I don't do chems. Laser pistol. Definitely not selling that. Uh, sell the mentats. Sell the mini nuke. Let's go ahead and do that. Okay, 49. We have 49 left. I don't want the... Oh, crap. I don't have enough to sell. Huh. Psycho. I think we're pretty... Pretty good. 
We'll sell that. Alright, let's go ahead and finish that. Now let's go over to Moira's side and see what she's got to sell. Combat armor. Combat armor, dude. I think I'm gonna buy it, actually. Energy cells? I do need more energy cells. Not yet. Okay, let's go ahead and finish that. Uh, she's got, uh, I got one. 21, oh god, that's gonna be expensive. Uh, but we can sell the minigun. It's not something I ever want to use. And we could sell the mini nuke. And then we'll come over here and then we'll see if we can buy all of this. There we go. And then I'm just paying her 28 caps. Very nice. Is there anything else? Leather armor? No, thank you. Metal helmet. Um, I don't see anything. Oh, stim packs. They're expensive, though. Oh, we're good. Good hunting. All right, later. See ya. Wait a minute. Uh, we should probably see. How are those hot little potatoes? If she can fix because, some stuff. Because you know they're on the ground, like potatoes, and hot because they um explode. Anyway, what's up? Yeah, that was uh, pretty dumb. Um, uh, hold on. I haven't been to Minefell uh, Field yet. All right. It's not just because they say the place is haunted, is it? Because that's no reason to avoid the place. That's pretty, Ghosts pretty good reason. don't exist. But landmines do. Oh boy, do they. And that's <laughs> what we need to study. You have some issues. Can you fix my stuff, please? Uh, can you reply to my equipment? a steaming pile of slag, I'd say yes. All right, definitely my laser pistol. Do I have nine caps? Is that what I have left? Fuck. <laughs> uh, combat armor. That costs 151. Yeah, I don't have enough caps. So let's go ahead and go. Good luck with that research. But I'm definitely putting that on. Oh, wait. What am I doing? Let's look at us. We look sexy. Sexy, sexy, sexy. Alright. Uh, where are we going? Oh, yeah. We're going to minefield. Data... Oh god, we haven't even discovered anything way up there yet. Well, it looks like we have a very long trek. How do I exit? Alright. Sims, you better not say nothing. That's what I thought. He's wanting to get blasted. How many... Uh, how much ammo do I have for my laser pistol? I have a decent little bit of mount. All right, let's get going. We have a long trek. A very long trek, as a matter of fact. It's all good, though. We'll be all right. Seriously, though, um... I, I, I don't necessarily know... What you get for finishing this, I'm not sure. I, I'm trying to remember. I'm not sure I've actually ever completed the Wasteland Survival Guide. But the interesting thing about this mission uh, in general is that it's actually canon. Like, it's canonical. Like, if you play, like, Fallout 4, for example... Uh, and you go to uh, what's a good what's a good example? Uh, okay, Sunshine Tidings Co-op, which is a potential settlement for you if you decide to claim it. 
in one of the little buildings in Sunshine uh, Tidings Co-op or whatever, you can actually find a Wasteland Survival Guide in there. I believe that one, if I remember correctly, I believe that one is for, uh, like, you get more food every time you s search an animal or something like that. Like, more meat. I don't know. So I can't remember. It's either that or Diamond City's uh, marked on your map. But... It's one or the other, at least that I can remember, but... Yeah, so the, just the fact that it's in the game, as and it's called wa actually Wasteland Survival God, Guide, which is what you're doing here with Moira, you're, in this game, you're actually making that magazine, which is pretty cool, man, that they actually made it canonical. I don't know, just my little tiny opinion. How far are we? Um... Holy shit, dude, we got a long way to go. It's all good, though, man. I don't mind looking at the scenery, because this game... For being as old as it is, this game is pretty freaking beautiful, man. Uh, let's go around this thing, because there's a bunch of... Uh, look, uh, what are they called? Tubs and shit with radiation. I don't know why I can't remember what it's called. Oh god, someone's over there. Uh-oh. And I do gotta say, the moon in this game, gorgeous. Top-notch. Love it. I'm literally a moon lover, just so you guys know. Like, I think the moon is beautiful as hell, dude. And they, they made this, they made, they made the moon look gorgeous in this game. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. I'm making a big deal about a freaking moon, aren't I? <laughs> oh well. It is what it is. Holy shit, dude. How far? How much longer do we have? Ah, we're not that far, actually. Look at that. We're a little over halfway. I feel like we're getting here pretty quick. Let's go ahead and, uh... Holy fuck, that scared the shit out of me. Run away! I'm just gonna put my stuff away and just book it, dude. Because I don't have ammo to be fighting for days, you know what I mean? But that scared the shit out of me. Oh, God. We got a freaking robot over here. Run away! I think we're getting into dangerous territory. Oh, God. They're shooting at me still. I've discovered a scrapyard. Why does this place... Why does this place sound familiar? Scrapyard. Why does this place sound familiar? I feel like something important's here. I kind of want to explore it. I don't know. I can't remember. Uh, def if you guys know why this place seems important to me, or if it's not important at all and I'm just crazy, let me know down in the comments, man. I feel like I've... Like something is there that I need to know. I don't know. Maybe I'm just crazy. But I think this is the town that we're supposed to go to. But the last time we were here, there was a freaking sniper. So we need to definitely avoid that sniper. Alright, what's the bonus for this? Uh, no wait. Quest. Wasteland Survival Guide. Um, bring Moira a landmine. Bring a landmine to Moira. Travel to the playground. Oh, this is easy. I just hope I don't blow up in the freaking process, dude. While we're getting shot at by a freaking sniper. All right, let's see. Just take it slow. You know, I've always thought that this looks like a freaking cell phone. All right. This is the this is the marker. We should probably All right, so since I'm using a controller, F5 doesn't work, so I got to do an actual save. All right, let's see. Come on, baby. Well, I see a landmine right here. Give it to me. I'm scared. 
I don't want to die. Got that one. Oh god. Dude, they're like, they're so bad. Holy fuck! I'm nervous. I'm legitimately nervous. And that's why. <laughs> Alright, let's take a stim pack. Before I die over here. Wait a minute. Oh, okay, I was about to say, do I not have stim packs? Hockey mask? No, thank you. Alright, where's the rest of these? Oh, look, the guy's over there shooting at me. We gotta hurry up, double time this. Oh, shit. I saw that coming. Oh, no. Where's this damn playground? Oh, I'm getting my ass beat here. This freaking asshole is shooting the hell out of me. I kind of want to... I, I kind of want to kill this guy. S screw this guy. Oh, shit. <laughs> I'm gonna die before I even get to him. I need to be a little bit careful, though. Oh, no. Well, um... Alright. No! Fuck, dude, there's so many of them. Um, I think he's a little higher up. Oh, no. Am I even gonna be able to kill him? Fuck you, dude. Fucking shooting me, you asshole. I'm over encumbered now. Search Arkansas. I I don't feel bad. I don't even care. Alright, let's take a freaking nap, dude. Do I have buff out? No. Um, what can I do here? I don't need... Wait, this... This gives me plus five to energy weapons. Combat armor doesn't give me plus anything. Maybe I should, uh... This gives me plus one perception, and I don't have anything on my head, so... That's going on. Uh, speech and melee weapons. Plus five to science. A lot of these can come in handy. 308, do I need that though? Like, do I? I mean, I guess it's better than the hunting rifle, so I'll drop that. Um, are we encumbered still? No. Alright, let's go ahead and get out of here. Oh wait, we never made it to the, uh, to the playground, did we? Yeah, we never made it to the playground, so let's go to the playground. Oh, shit. I saw that as I was landing. I'm literally going to take as many as, as of these as possible. Because I'm going to sell them to Moira. Whatever she doesn't take. No! Oh, God. That was scary. Alright, where's this freaking playground? I know it's around here somewhere. Can't hide from me, playground. There it is. Alright, return to Moira. I keep pushing pause. Alright, let's go all the way back to Megaton. Dude, we got destroyed. Hey, we got destroyed. Like, absolutely destroyed by that old man. I don't feel bad either, man. I'm pretty sure he has his own backstory, but I don't even care. He was a named NPC, so I'm sure there was something, something up with him. But I don't care. He was trying to kill me first. I was defending myself. That's what I see it. And it didn't give me a notice that, uh... Oh, Nathan, you just scared the shit out of me. Get out of the way. It didn't give me no negative karma or anything, so... Nope, I don't feel bad. How are those hot little potatoes? Or whatever. You know what I mean. Yeah, sure, why not. Um... I got through Minefield Alive, and I even brought you a present. My very own landmine! Oh, just what I've always wanted. Well, always since I sent you out on this anyway. <laughs> now, tell me all about it. What was it like going through there? What's it like disarming a landmine? Uh... 
There may have been an explosion or two. Oh, and a sniper. You know, no big deal. The usual. Oh, well, if that's all, I'll just study this and hope there aren't any more explosions, shall I? I know you may not want to see any more explosives for a while, but obviously you know your way around them. Have a couple rainy day toys of mine. And looking at this landmine, it gives me an idea. It's a terrible device that does terrible things, of course. But it's easy to make your own, too. Um, if you say so. Wait, does that mean she gave me schematics? Yeah, schematics, bottle cap mine. Hell yeah. Alright, so the last part of this chapter is about radiation, right? Yes, that's what I need your help on. I know lots about it from books. But I never seem to get a live example. Not for long, anyway. So I need you to get a bit of radiation poisoning so I can study its effects. Oh, not a deadly dose, of course. I can fix you up before that. Well, I mean, all right. I suppose I'll get irradiated for you. Just make sure you're ready with some, uh, like, rataways and stuff like that, man, because I'm pretty sure I'm going to need them, all right? Oh, you're a peach, or at least some sort of hardy fruit that grows in the savagely irradiated mockery of agriculture we have nowadays. <laughs> now, 200 rads should be enough for basic sickness, but if you can get 600 or more rads, my test will be even more accurate. Just make sure you can get back here, and I'll see to it that you're well taken care of. Alright, sounds good. But first, let me sell you, you some need? stuff. Alright, uh, I definitely want to sell her the landmines. Where are the landmines? Alright, definitely the frag grenades too. Landmines, all eight of them. Uh, I don't do melee, and I think that's what this does, so I'm going to sell that. Um, not selling my freaking laser pistol, that much is for sure. Honestly, I think that's pretty much it. Hmm. Yeah, that's it. Let's look through her inventory one more time. I mean, we could get 556, five, but nah. Um, I was tempted to buy the combat armor. But no, nah, that's that wouldn't that wouldn't be a good idea. At least not yet. If anything, Stim packs. Good hunting. No. Alright, let's go ahead and go. Come back soon. You better be ready, Moira, I'm Hi telling there. you. I'm about to get a whole dose of radiation. So basically what I'm gonna do is just quite literally stand in this water until I get six hundred rads. And it's two rads a second, so it's literally gonna take a while. Can I literally all right, you lack the explosives. All right, no worries. So we're basically just going to stand here until we get 600 rads. Um, but I'm going to do a hard cut, man, because it's literally going to take a while. Like the last time I did this, I think it took like 5 to 10 minutes or something like that. So we're definitely going to just do a hard cut right now, and then uh, we'll be back once we have 600 rads. And give relief to this rock. All right, so we now have gotten 600 rads, and I'm so fucked up, I can't jump or walk around or nothing, so I hope I don't die. Oh, God. Uh, I have to go over there. Oh, my God, this is going to take a while. We are so messed up right now. Moira better be freaking happy, because I'm dying right now. Quite literally, as a matter of fact. Come on, baby. We can make it. Is that what advanced radiation? Or critical radiation? Because this is even more than advanced. But yeah, dude, we were standing there. Let me see. Nine, uh, we were standing there for six minutes. Getting two rads a second. Trying to get irradiated. Up until we got 600 rads. Um, took a while. But we got it. And we'll get to, we'll get to her freaking shop eventually. Is she named? 
Nope, just Mega Ten Settler. Come on, baby. Whoa, we're almost there. Almost there. Moira, fix me. Oh, feeling a bit under the weather? Or a bit over the Geiger counter? <laughs> uh, try both. Uh, I'm about as irradiated as I can get without burning a hole on the floor. I can tell. You're positively glowing. I'll take that as a compliment. Now, just hold on and try not to move. Tell me how it feels, and I'll get you fixed right up. Pretty freaking terrible, dude. I have 600 rads. Uh, just do your examination and fix me up, please. You're a mighty lucky one, you know that? At this state, most people have trouble standing up, much less walking over here. Now, let me take a few notes, and I'll handle that nasty radiation with a bit of my own homemade rad cure concoction. Okay. I've never had a chance to test it out on someone so heavily dosed, but I'm sure it'll work out fine. <laughs> Exciting, isn't it? No. <laughs> okay, a little Brahmin milk, a couple magnets, and maybe a few happy thoughts. Well, you're alive. Oh, that's the good news. But there was a little side effect. A teeny tiny, um, mutation. Uh, but it seems to be benign, at least. Here, take a few radiation chems. As my little way of saying, I'm sorry I twisted your DNA like a kitten with a ball of yarn. Uh, rad regeneration perk added. Moira's experiment had an unexpected side effect. Uh, now when you suffer advanced, uh, from advanced radiation poisoning, crippled limbs automatically regenerate. Well, I mean, that's cool. So that completes the first, uh, chapter tasks, correct? Yup, you've done a great job. I just need to add in the section on how to cook rat, and this chapter's done. Here, for your services, I've saved up quite a few stim packs. Of course, you may need them. We still've got two more chapters to go. Yep. So I'm ready to start uh, researching for the next chapter. The second chapter is going to be a bit trickier, I think. It'll cover how to handle creatures out there, for better or worse. For example, repelling mole rats, uh, learning about mire lurks, and when all else fails, how to handle being injured. So let's buckle down and get to work on this chapter. What's first? Uh, let's do the mole rats, I suppose. Mole rats can burrow into almost anything and cause a lot of trouble. So I figured I'd make a chemical repellent stick for people to shoo them off. But I need it to be tested before I put the recipe to paper in the guide. So I need you to find some mole rats and test it out a bit. Sure, why not? Your tests are absolutely insane, Moira. I just hope you understand this. It'll be easy. One tap with the applicator, and it overwhelms their senses with a sort of feel-bad sensation. Then they're gone before you know it. You could test it out on just a few mole ratties. But for real testing, try it on ten or more. There should be plenty in the tepid sewers downtown. Alright, yeah, we're definitely going to go for ten. So, let's go. Um, Laters. Have fun out there, okay? So, I don't think she completely fixes you up. Is there any way I could check it? Um. How can I check how much rads I have right now? Or can I? I don't know. If it's going to be anywhere, it's got to be here, right? Limbs? Body? Oh, wait. Body, rads. There we go. Alright, so we, we do. We have zero. And 16% rad resistance. Alright. No problem. Condition. Oh, yeah. I forgot I was wearing that stupid hat. <laughs> All right, so we got to go to the tepid sewer, she said. Where is that? Um, we haven't been there yet, so let's go to... Okay, well, the wharf is literally right next to it, so let's go there, and I know it's safe. What does she have for sale again? 
Lurks ain't got you yet, I see. Nope. You need some trading? Uh, yeah, sure, I'm interested. I was good to hear. Let's see what you got. That, that's it? That's all you got? Uh, let me double check and see if I have anything to sell her. Um, really doesn't look like it. No, I don't think there's anything. All right, later. Y'all come back now, you hear? Nope. I don't want to cross through there, so I'm going to go across the bridge. Actually, it's in that direction anyways. Let's go ahead and stay strapped up just in case. Uh, alrighty then. Anchorage War Memorial. Let's go, homeboy. Dude, this combat armor looks sick as hell. Wait, hold on. Do I? Uh, Tepid Sewers. DuPont Station. I feel like we're in a dangerous situation here. So this is for mole rats, right? Look, there goes uh, one of those abominations. Uh, we need to put on that one's repellent stick. Luckily, the... This thing is ugly. No, Anchorage Memorial? It's not here. It can't be here. Right? Uh, world map. Oh, okay, no, it's not right here. It's on the other side of here. What the hell's going on right now? I'm nervous. Is that a seller? Oh, it's just a scavenger. Can we talk to him? Oh my god. No, it's it's his Yao Guar. Back off. Alright, 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 alright. I'm not I don't your shit is not that serious, bro. Kinda wanna kill him though. <laughs> alright, it should be right around here, I think. Oh yeah, dude, yeah, it's right in there. Oh god, there goes some Meyer lurks. Oh god, be careful. There we go, tepid sewers. Let's kick some mole rat ass. Ah. Die! So that was what, two? Did someone just shoot? They better not be taking my freaking kills! Get them, mole rats! Kill them! Watch well, it be a good guy. Someone who would probably have my back. Let's look over here. Ah! So that was three. Nah, bruh. Oh, I got purified water for that one homeless guy, too. I need seven more. Uh... Oh, God. No! All right, that was four. Come on, baby, where are they all at? They're literally all dead. Oh God, dude, they're literally all dead. There goes one. Uh, that's five, six, seven. I need three more if my counts are correct. 
But I don't think there is very many left. Oh god. Fuck me. Run! Crap, dude. They really are dead. First aid box. Where can I find... Oh, God. Where can I find more mole rats? I don't... I legitimately don't know. Does this... This is the exit, right? Yeah. There's got to be another area. But there isn't, though. Alright. I'm going to switch weapons. And I'm going to destroy... that turret where is it is it de it's down here right yep right there come on one more shot there we go all right and let's put our repellent stick back on Oh, we haven't searched that door. So let's go ahead and do that before we make some rash decisions. I don't think we've searched those either. No! Don't be dead! I need three more of you guys! Come on, little fellas. Where are you guys at? Open door. Oh, there's a landmine right there, too. Wait, who the hell is this? Rack salt? Um, look at all these landmines. Holy shit, dude. Oh, God. Oh, God. Let's go ahead and, uh, switch weapons, shall we? I wonder if she will die if she comes over here. Oh, I got an idea. That didn't work. You ready to die, Rock Salt? I'm glad we established that. I need to not push the rock buttons, but I'm gonna take this Rock Salt's key, all right. Just so that I can uh, fix this shotgun real quick. Sure, why not? All right, let's go. Screw it. YOLO. Look at all these landmines. These are literally money makers for me. Two stim packs, don't mind if I do. Ammunition, 5.56, five, all right. Shotgun shells. I hear... Oh, God. Uh, where's my shotgun? Oh, no, there's somebody else. How many are there? Holy shit. Oh, my God, dude. That takes forever in this game. I look all freaking ridiculous, dude, with combat armor and, uh, and a little freaking hat. Alright, let's go ahead and fix this again. Nothing in- is there anything in here for us? Wait, lock, use key. Hey, cool. Very nice. Alright. What we should do is sell- our, our, uh, what are they called? Ooh. Our stealth boys. Oh, it's empty. I don't know why I searched that. All right, let's go. Like, I could have sworn I heard some, uh, mole rats, though. Oh, fuck. Ouch. 
I definitely hear mole rats. So let's put on our stick. Oh god, I gotta be careful here. Hey, what's up, buddy? Can't tell you how happy I am to see you guys. I think I just need one more. Die! Is that it? Yeah! Uh, since I don't need this no more, though, we're definitely going back to our combat shotgun. Let's see if we can find a way out without having to go through all that freaking landmines shit. What the hell was that? Alright, screw it. I'm going backwards. <laughs> We're not trying to die here. Plus, there's beds back there, so. Wait, hold on. Okay, yeah, I came this way. Shouldn't be too far, anyways. Let's just go in here and take a quick nap. Just so that we can literally get our limb fixed and our health topped off again. It's over here. And nothing. Very nice. Very nice. Now we're in tip top shape. Did I search this? I didn't search now. I don't want to carry too many landmines either. Alright, I'm pretty sure we're going the right direction. Let's just double check and verify that we actually did. Yep, the optional's done. Sick. Alright, now I gotta remember how the hell to get out of here. Yep, alright, this is the way. I remember because of that, uh... That terminal that was down there. So this should be the exit right here. Awesome. And now we can fast travel back to Megaton. We are right. still breathing. Let's go ahead and wait 12 hours. That way we can just run straight inside because once we get there, it's going to be closed. And Dunskies. Some of these sound effects are creepy, dude. Megaton is a, like, conceptually speaking, it's a pretty cool place. Hey, Moira. Oh, I can't wait to hear how the repellent's working. Um. I tested the mole rat uh, repellent extensively, actually. Oh, excellent. Substantial field testing. Precise reports and such dedication. <laughs> what more could I ask for in a research assistant? So, how did my chemical repellent work? Safe and clean like a charm, I'll bet. Um, it appears that bull rats have a most fatal allergy to it. Explosively so. Those poor little mole ratties. <laughs> oh, I wonder if I could make a hypoallergenic version. Oh, but that'd hardly be effective. I should mention that. Proper handling of mole rats could be important if they could be domesticated. Milked, maybe? Oh, anyway, keep the repellent. Gross. Oh, but for your trouble, um, here, have the leftover chems from working on the repellent. I'm sure you can find some use for them. Uh, I'm ready for more, uh, research on the second chapter. There's a lot we don't know about Mirelurks and how intelligent and dangerous they are. That definitely deserves research. I hesitate to ask, but I'll need to examine the effects of serious physical trauma. I wouldn't ask if I couldn't fix you up afterwards, of course. And that should be it for the second chapter. Which do you want to check out? Um... Uh... Yeah. 
All right, so I'm gonna hate myself for for this, but what do you mean about handling injury? Well, I never get to study anyone who's severely injured. Not without them crying to be fixed right away or trying to bleed out and all that. But obviously, you can handle a lot of abuse. So if I'm ever going to find a good example of human anatomy and injury resistance, it'd be you. Next time you get badly injured, return here so I can examine you before I heal you up. I mean, you're going to get yourself hurt anyway, right? Um, I guess... I'll get hurt eventually. Might as well come here when I do, right? Wow, what a great research assistant you are. I mean, really, that's dedication. Demonstrating how to withstand pain by getting injured? Wow. When you're ready, come back here with some serious injuries. Maybe a crippled limb or two. And I'll take notes and fix you up. I'll be waiting here with plenty of bandages for you. So don't worry. Just go get horribly injured. Oh, and be careful. I'm gonna regret this. Alright, let's go. Later. Come back soon. Uh... Let's see, hold on. What's the mission? Become seriously injured 50% health or less. Receive a crippling injury. This is gonna be easy, man. All I gotta do is put down landmines. But we're definitely going to call it a video right here, right now, you guys. Um, we're actually a little bit over halfway, I think, of the Wasteland Survival Guide. So in the next uh, video, we're probably going to finish this. And then I kind of want to do the Replicated Man, so we're probably going to end up doing that following this mission. So if that's something you're excited for, do me a huge favor. Drop a like on this video. Also, subscribe to the channel if you're not already subscribed because it really does help this channel grow. So with that being said, catch you guys in the next video. Deuces. Thank you.